are about to see a Lego obstacle course tested out by Lego WWE figures. Okay, here's the layout. So first, you climb up the climbing net. Then you have the first body of water. You have to swing across it with a chain. Then you hit the first patch of grass. Then you cross the second body of water by using the skinny white balance beam. Then you hit the second patch of grass. Then you have to hop across the stones and you go under the arch of doom. Then you have to flip a tire until you reach the lava. Then once you reach the lava, you have to sprint across it and you come to a crossroads. You can either take the shortcut, which is the battleship that is supposed to go right to the finish line and give you first place, or you can go through the slide of death, which is the green path. So there's a slide of death. And then you go up to the finish line, which is paradise, and you get greeted by Emmett from the Lego movie. Okay, here's the first contestant. Ooh, that's a nice car. What is that? Is that Rey Mysterio? I think that's Rey Mysterio in the back. Why is he riding like that? Rey Mysterio is getting out. Why didn't he just ride in the cab? Okay, here's the second contestant. Ooh, that's a nice helicopter. Okay, let's see who it is. Oh, the big reveal. Who has the nice helicopter? And it's Roman Reigns. Roman Reigns has the nice helicopter. And he is the second contestant. Okay, now let's see the next contestant. Oh, and it's the dead man. He, peer, he appears out of thin air. The dead man, the undertaker himself, appears out of nowhere. And the fourth contestant rolling in with a monster truck. And he's going to run over the dead man. And he, he destroys the undertaker's classical bike. No! And he just runs him over. And, and he's still going. He's still driving over the top of him. And he's still going, just crushing the Undertaker. I wonder who's driving that vehicle. Well, I still don't know who dri who's driving it, but it it's Kofi Kingston's truck. And he just leaves the Undertaker. His bike is in ruins, and so is the Undertaker. And the Undertaker just revives himself. How is that possible? Okay, really? Seth Rollins just is walking in? Lame. Boo. Lame. Ooh, let's see who's next. Oh my gosh! Look at that horsepower! That's three commercial jet airliner jet engines on a tiny lifeboat. Okay, that's really funny. And then, uh, let's see, John Moxley's showing off his strength. Okay, who's going to be next? I don't believe it. A space shuttle comes in. I haven't seen one of those in person. Until now. Oh, look at those driving skills. I wonder who's in there. Who is piloting that ship so skillfully? And who even has the money to buy one of those? Well, maybe he rented. Oh, and the wings go down? Nice. Who is in there? The big reveal. The hatch is opening up. And it's Seamus. Seamus is the one that was piloting the spaceship. I don't believe it. Seamus. Seamus crawls out of the amazing vehicle. Where did he get his hands on one of those? Alright, just taking a good look at the vehicles. We'll look at the wealth in those vehicles. And look at all the contestants. There are seven of them. Okay, first up is The Undertaker. The Undertaker making his way toward the climbing net. And he begins climbing. 
Okay, and he reaches the ridge, and now it's for the chain swing. Okay, the Undertaker grabs the chain, and he goes for it. And he swings down, almost touches the water, but then he lands safely on the first patch of grass. Okay, next up, Kofi Kingston. Kofi Kingston trying to catch the Undertaker here. Kofi Kingston begins climbing. And Kingston swings across. And he too lands safely on the first patch of grass. And now what is the Undertaker doing? The Undertaker he he's getting off. He's going off track. What is he doing? I think I think he's trying to get revenge at Kofi Kingston for running over his his motorcycle. What is he doing? He's messing with the system. Let's see what happens. Oh, and he makes Kofi Kingston fall. Kofi Kingston is in the garbage cans. Now he's getting all tangled up in them. How embarrassing. But then again, Kofi Kingston did run over the Undertaker's bike and the Undertaker and almost killed him. I guess it's fair. And Rey Mysterio up next. Rey Mysterio is showing off here. Oh, wait, back to the Undertaker and Kofi Kingston. They're advancing across the balance beam. And what is Kofi Kingston doing? Kofi Kingston is going to try to push the Undertaker. Kofi Kingston pushes the Undertaker. The Undertaker is in the water. And I don't believe it. Out of nowhere, just like the dead man himself, an alligator appears. And he's... He bit the head off the dead man. And the dead man sinks into the water. The Undertaker has been eliminated by Kofi Kingston. How could he do such a thing? And Rey Mysterio. Rey Mysterio was scaling the chain. Rey Mysterio has climbed up above the chain. He beat the system. Okay, next up is John Moxley. And Rey Mysterio holding an evil looking blade. He just cut down the chain. Seth Rollins coming up behind John Moxley. Seth Rollins is just pushing John Moxley into the water. And the alligator will claim another victim. But this time he only bit off John Moxley's head. Rey Mysterio with that evil looking weapon. Just as fast as it appeared, it disappeared. And Rey Mysterio jumps down to the first patch of grass. Back to Kofi Kingston now. Kofi Kingston, I don't believe it. Out of nowhere comes this semi. Kofi Kingston trying to make a run for it. He's too panicked. And then the semi just runs over him. Kofi Kingston is definitely out. Kofi Kingston is the third one eliminated. Where did that semi come from? Rey Mysterio going across the balance beam. Rey Mysterio has such good athleticism that he just sprints across it. Right, Rey Mysterio has officially made it the farthest in the race. And he's hopping across those stones. And he enters the Arch of Doom. Right, and Rey Mysterio is going to be the only one that has to do the tire flip today. Rey Mysterio just flipping that tire like no man's business. And Rey Mysterio reaches the lava. Okay, let's take another look at Seth Rollins. Seth Rollins, what a cheater. Seth Rollins uses John Moxley as a stepping stone to get across the water. Poor John Moxley. And Seth Rollins, passing up Kofi Kingston, advancing towards the Arch of Doom. And he's getting closer to Rey Mysterio. Oh, and Rey Mysterio is sprinting across the lava. What is happening? Oh my gosh, I don't believe it. There's a plane out of nowhere. A plane just comes and hits Rey Mysterio. 
so unexpected. Where did that thing come from? And Seth Rollins running across the lava. Seth Rollins is waiting an awful long time trying to decide which path he's going to take. Oh, and Seth Rollins has waited so long in the lava, it has burned away his legs. But looks like he's going to be dragging himself across the cheater route. He's advancing toward the battleship. And he gets on the battleship. And the battleship starts moving away from the finish line. Where is it going? This... It... It... It, it was a trap. And Seth Rollins is being pulled to who knows where. Way behind the starting line. Where is he going? This is a dark and eerie place. And I don't believe it. There's a dinosaur. A Tyrannosaurus Rex to be exact. And Seth Rollins apparently doesn't even see it. He's going right toward it. And it's advancing on Rollins. And it's going to eat Seth Rollins. And Seth Rollins has been eaten. And the dinosaur just runs away. Oh my gosh. What a bad way to go out. And the dinosaur is nowhere to be seen. Alright, back to Seamus here. And Roman Reigns. Meanwhile... Seamus is coming across while Roman Reigns climbs up on the Arch of Doom. Seamus advancing on the Arch of Doom. And, and it looks like Seamus didn't even realize that Roman Reigns was on top. Was Roman Reigns trying to trick Seamus? Seamus advancing toward the lava begins his sprint. And he gets to the crossroads. Where does he go? Okay. Seamus will be the first one to take the, the slide of death. But Roman Reigns slowly advancing. Seamus is already at the top of the ladder. I wonder what's going to happen here. Oh, Roman Reigns moves in for the low blow. Then he throws him off the staircase. And they tumble to the ground. I don't know. Who's going to win this? Is Seamus going to come up, or is Roman Reigns going to hurt Seamus? And Roman Reigns, what is he doing? And Roman, and Roman Reigns just pulls Seamus' head off. How brutal is that? Seamus' dead body just falls to the ground, and Roman Reigns slides into victory. And Roman Reigns advancing on the finish line. I can't believe what he just did. How brutal. And Roman Reigns comes in to greet Emmett. What's going to happen? Roman Reigns is sitting down, getting the award ceremony. And I don't believe it. Roman Reigns has been launched. Not even the winner wins. Roman Reigns is just launched off the, the finish line. Because in this tournament, everyone loses.